Uh, so obviously mental health is something that I think we've seen a huge increase in need um, across the last maybe six or seven years. Um, I think even prior to COVID, um, we had the introduction of mental health leads within school, which wasn't something that we'd, I know that wasn't something in place when I first started within education. So I think we are definitely moving in the right direction. Um, in terms of provisions here at Glynn, I think we are really lucky in the sense that we have a counsellor uh, within school who is, who is just based at Glynn. Uh, we work with the mental health team, um, which is NHS based. Um, and then we also, you know, offer additional emotional based interventions. Um, and there's a real clear ladder, um, you know, for students to access support. Um, that also means that the students are able to access support in an environment where they feel safe and comfortable, but at different levels. There will be students where, you know, emotional based interventions from us as a SEND department is, is adequate and that's all that they need but there will be other students who need something from someone who is trained within that particular area, which is when we would look to the mental health team or possibly the school counsellor. And, you know, I think that's really, really important. And also it's really important that we're open to have conversations about that um, and the support that we have on offer so that if a student is feeling or experiencing something that they that is having an impact on their mental health that they feel that they can go to someone and say look I, I think I need help with this um, and you know however they feel comfortable doing that whether it's that they go to their parent and then their parent comes to us or they come to us themselves I think you know having those relationships then not just with the student but also with the families that we work with within the school is then also really really important um, and I also think education as a whole, um, my personal opinion, is changing in a way that is, is, is potentially supporting mental health a lot more. There's more focus on relationships with students and making sure that we get to know them and that they're environments that feel safe. Um, from past experience working within Wandsworth as a local authority, there was a big emphasis on trauma-enforced approach and encouraging schools to be able to demonstrate that within their classroom. Um, I know within that local authority it was in its infancy, um, but I think there's a lot to be learned from those ideas and those things that are being moved forward within local authorities and within particular mental health teams to the classroom and how we're really working with students and building those relationships with them.